This video illustrates how to edit a VoiceThread. Remember to get started you want to first sign up for the slide that you'll be adding to the VoiceThread and two, locate the online image that you want to add to your slide. This is the image here that I want to add to my slide and I have the image URL identified. Remember it starts with HTTP and it ends with JPG. I'm going to keep that open in one tab and toggle over to VoiceThread in another tab. What I've done is I've gone to VoiceThread.com, signed into my account, as you can see with my email address here, and I've clicked on the My Voice tab. Now what I want to do is find the VoiceThread that I want to edit. You have editing privileges for one VoiceThread and it's the one titled Pictorialism. So find that voice thread and click on the, men the gear menu in the lower right corner, the little gear menu. It's going to say show options when you mouse over it. I'm going to click there and when you see this appear you want to click on edit. And now a new page is going to open. This is the edit page. It's probably something that looks very unfamiliar to you. What you want to do here is upload the image that you have selected. Once you upload that image it's going to appear as your new slide. So what you want to do is click on number one, upload. Now you have options. What you want to do is click on URL. Click on URL if you have the image located online and you have the image URL already copied to your clipboard, like I just showed you. Now in this box, just paste the image URL. Whoops, and I don't have the correct one there. Hold on, don't do as I just showed you. I'm going to go back there and do that again. So I'm copying that URL. I'm going back to that box. I'm just going to paste it in there. There we go. That worked that time. And I'm going to click on import. Now watch what happens. In a moment, a new slide will open with your image on it. You have now added your slide. That's all you need to do in upload. Your next step is to click on comment. and go to the slide you just added. There it is. Now what I'm going to do is add my comments, keeping in mind that I need to include the information that is listed in the slide sign-up sheet. From here it's pretty much just like all of your other VoiceThread activities. I hope that helps.